life every day late at night not okay all i want and i pray all i need are some better day good morning today is our last morning at interlaken we are waiting for the bus to come i think it's coming soon i can't hear you no it's not bye we are going to lucen next Having breakfast on the train. This one quite cheap. It was one thirty franc. And then this one is his favorite uh, sandwich. What's it called? Some cheese sandwich. Some cheese sandwich. It's quite good actually the cheese. And then this is the croissant, which is quite cheap also. It's ninety five franc. It's um, to be honest cheaper than Singapore like, I feel. Good and then this one is two dollar and ninety five cents. As usual, it's a very small room, but the Airbnb um host is very kind, very nice. Like there's this like drying rack over here, whereby you put your towels and stuff, it will dry very fast. And then after that, like there's even an aircon because in Switzerland, I don't know why the last two there isn't any aircons at all because they are like the temperature are generally already quite cold. And then he even has a mini bar, right? And all the drinks inside, huh? It's free. You can see the gimbal in which you can let me open it. Yeah, everything is free. And he even pasted a Singapore city. Is it because he know we are from Singapore? Oh really? Yeah. So really? cute. <laughs> is it? Yeah, really? I think so. so cute. Yeah, so cute. So we are actually sharing the apartment with the host itself, but he's uh barely here. I think he's always travelling or something. Yeah. And it's really very nice, eh? super thoughtful. Like he has a lot of stuff and he he even like compiled like this PDF to introduce to like give us his recommendation, blah 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 blah. And we are staying very very near the the city center. Walking over to our lunch spot, it's currently what time? So twelve forty. Uh, and then this restaurant is recommended by our Airbnb host and we also found it online ourselves and then it has quite good reviews actually it's like 4.6 with 400 plus reviews if I'm not wrong on Google and it's a French restaurant yeah we're quite excited for it can you see it? it's called Le Lapin That's the veal liver with hash brown, which is the rosti. Then I am having the saffron ross risotto and the what's that? Some pork cooked with wine. We are walking towards the first bridge. This is the second bridge. I totally forgot to block the very first bridge. But there's nothing much lah, unless you love this kind of thing. Oh my god, and there's a lot of insects here.
This is their natural cloudy beer. And then this is their special. I uh, don't have a name. It's special. It's a, it, it changes with seasons. Yeah, correct. So there's only one special. And it's we got the small. So actually the small is quite, quite a lot already. This is part of the glacier garden and oh, this is actually a maze. Is it? It's a maze, right? I don't know what is this, but this is the second part or maybe the first part. I don't know. There's no sequence to it. Yeah. Well, them, them cool. And then you can just climb up this small little like tree house kind of structure. Wow. You want to try more? Yeah. Or should we try this? So pretty. It's so tall, right? <laughs> Because you too high, so so potato inside the cheese. I quite love it. Do it. You actually they will give you a plate of um cheese. I don't know whether you can see it. Cheese with pickles as well as your onion. Is it onion? And then afterwards, you just put it onto this special tray. After it kind of melt, right? Then you just put uh, 